Hello everybody, welcome back. This is Nilnar, and today we're in Dragon Age, the Valgard. I've been looking forward to this ever since they announced it was releasing this month. Um, you won't see it until Monday, but uh, this is uh, playing it when it first came out. Uh, I hope uh, you all enjoyed this as much as I'm looking forward to it, and let's get into a brand new game. So excited. I as Solus. Smart, thoughtful, loved to hear himself talk. But long ago, he had a different name. The Dreadwolf. Ancient elven god of lies, or heroic rebel against tyranny. Depending on which story you believe. In his desperate fight against the corrupt elven gods, Solus imprisoned them creating a veil that split our world from the raw magic of the Fade. He had won. But the veil cost the elves everything. Their magic, their freedom, even their immortality. Now, Solus wants to tear down that veil and undo the damage he caused. Even if that means our world has to burn. Mm. Somebody's got to stop him. And that's where you come in. Mr. Varric. So who do we want to play? We've got the Elf Lineage. The Karnar. Kunar, eh? Weird and even for their size and strength. Strict philosophy from their homeland. Elf is descendant of the ancient fallen empire. That's probably who I'll play, but we'll see. We got the old human. And then we got the dwarf. Hmm. Can't use magic, but their combat is feared. And what they have here. All kinds of stuff. I'm half tempted to do a dwarf just to do something different. I normally play the human because I usually like to get into the magic. But I'm thinking elf this time. Yeah, that's what we're going to do. So I'm going to work on customizing this up. And I'll bring you back when I get them customized. Okay, I have one put together. Um, well, we're going to stay with a nice starter outfit. And we're going to play it. Uh, see what happens. I did pick a warrior type class and I kind of picked what I would have done from acquisition to pick out my beginning area so where were we oh right him our best plan is to stop the dread wolf before he can perform his ritual after following his trail across half the known world we finally tracked him to Manrathus, capital of the Tevinter Imperium. But to find the Dreadwolf in a city this big, we need a local expert. Yes, we do. So, naturally, our story begins where all great stories begin. With the seediest bar in town. And a missing contact. Let's try this again. Where's Nev Gallus? You think you can come into my bar and make demands? Sure, why not?
Be nice. It's diplomatic. not a demand. It's an offer. Telling me what I need to know. It's it's the smart play here. How'd you figure, sweet talker? Nev Gallus is my only shot at finding the Dreadwolf. I need to know where she is. We were supposed to meet here, in your bar. But you let Venatory cultists drag her away. I didn't let them. They paid me. <laughs> so answer my questions and walk away with the coin. Or spend it cleaning up the place when I'm through. Your choice. You're adorable. Dumat Plaza. That's that what good. Nef Gallus. But really good. Thank you. You want to get yourself killed fighting the Venatori? It's your ass. That offer's good for all of you, too. No? If they won't listen to you, they can always listen to Bianca. <laughs> oh, he's like Bianca. <laughs> Your friend Nev Gallus is at Dumont Plaza. I heard. That's why you're my second in command. Although, for the record, you might be too charming for your own good. What did I have to worry about? You were there watching my back. Yeah, yeah. Come on. Harding will be worried. All right. Break's over. I hope Nev's as good at finding people as you claim. She's the best damn detective I've ever met. If she says she's got a lead on Solus, I believe her. Wow. That looks cool. The Archon's Palace. Something must have gotten them riled up. Should we be in more of a hurry to get out of here? We don't want to look conspicuous. Just get out of here nice and casual. Find Nev Gallus and stop Solus. Hello, hello, hello. You still think you can talk him down before he starts his big ritual? That ritual is going to tear down the veil. The only thing separating us from the Fade and an endless number of demons. I have to talk him down. Wait! But I didn't do anything! Get down! Are they after us? Is it because of the bar? Word travels fast in Minrathus. We've got to help her. We don't have time to get arrested, especially if we... What are they doing? Oh, crap. We're too late. The ritual started. But if we hurry, we can still stop Solus before it finishes. Let's go! Harding's this way. She'll get us to do our push. Then Nev will get us to Solus. Watch out! Is Solus summoning demons on purpose? My guess is the veil is weakening, and they're slipping through the cracks. And when the veil comes down completely... Then the whole world is going to look a lot like this! Come on, this way. It should get us to Harding. Oh, come on, let's go. Jump over objects. You're safe now. Get inside and bar the door as quick as you can, okay? Thank you, miss. Harding, you all right? I've been doing what I can to help. The ritual must be weakening the veil. There are a lot of scared people out here. And a lot of demons. Haven't seen this many come through the fade in years. 
And what about you two? Are you okay? We're better. Fought some demons, and the Archon's palace took a few shots at us. Nothing we couldn't handle. Speak for yourself. <laughs> Have you got my gear? Right over there. Ooh, there we go. Where's Nev Gallus? Wasn't she at the meeting point? The Venatori got to her first. They grabbed her before we arrived and paid off the bar owner to keep it quiet. I'm not surprised our detective did something to piss off a cult of murderous blood mages, but their timing stinks. The bar owner said the Venatori took Nev to Dumont Plaza. Can you get us there, Harding? Not a problem. I saw Dumont Plaza while I was scouting the area, and it was crawling with Venatori. Follow me. Eyes up! We've got company! Those are cool. They look cool. Demon. Extra light attack. I uh, do it four times in a row to do an attack chain. Last one is the final deals increased damage. Okay. Here they come. Get to Dumont Plaza and find Nev. You two all right? I don't want to drink the potion, but I can with the right button. Good. I don't get it. If Solus tears down the veil, doesn't you are in violation of Imperial order? Oh no, I think that's Dumont Plaza. Let's move. Oh, something going on down there. Assholes. Looks like the Venatori put up a barrier to block the way. More intruders! Avenge our fallen brethren! Friendly bunch of cultists, aren't they? Cross paths with the Veil Jumpers. They were hunting for magic and putting people in danger. Yep, that's them. Nice. Come on. Guess we're yeah. sliding down. The allies of Neb Gallus! Kill them all! A new diving kick ability for shifty rage with the bright man. Oh, that's not cool. But it looks like Nev's work, not the Venatori's. <laughs> Hello? Beric, hiding. Not the worst timing. Nev, it's so good to see you. We thought the Venatori had kidnapped you. They thought the same thing. A lot of Venatori in the city have reason to hate me. Figured I'd play along. Find out who wanted to settle the score this time. Then the sky started raining demons. So I'm back on the job. Appreciate it. Rook, this is Nev Gallus, our local expert. She's gonna help us find Solus. Nev, meet Rook. Harding and I found him a while back. Thought we could use an expert on trouble. Rook, like the chess piece? One of the strongest pieces on the board, but <laughs> he tends to think in straight lines.
Nice to meet you. Based on the Venatori, you've got excellent taste in enemies. I do my best. You said you had a lead? I haven't seen Solus in person, but I did find hints of old magic, similar to what you get in Elven Ruins. Ooh. Oh, it's like a good Elven Ruins. I traced it to a building beneath Our Lady of Victory. That's where your man is hiding. Then let's go. Before this ritual he's doing gets any worse. Worse? This ritual's already drawing more power than I'd expect from a dozen mages. You told me he was working alone. I also told you he was an ancient elven god. An elven god? Well... Whatever he is, he's causing trouble in my city. Let's go. So we got a, a rogue ranger type, a dwarf rogue, a warrior, and now a, a caster in our group. Nice little combination. So if we do catch Solus, or the Dreadwolf, whatever he calls himself, what's the plan? He wants to bring down the veil. Hopefully that ritual takes his full attention. So we catch him while he's doing his ritual so he can't fight us. That's the hope. If it comes to a straight up fight, we're dead. We can slide down the line to get across. Yeah. Getting too old for this. Yeah, but it's fun. Nice job. Looking good. Guys, yeah. looking good. That's the building I tracked Solus to. Looks like the Venatari also found it. And then demons found them. Right click to do. I want to use my trigger to pack. And Enchantment on the entrance. I can get it. Yeah, let's go in and check this out. I'll so lead on the warrior. Hide out. One of them at least. I'm not sure how long he's been here. Some of this looks ancient. Solus has been around longer than Menrathus itself. He does pretty good at jumping. I was kind of wondering how the dwarf was going to get up here. But he made it. Well, that's interesting. Beautiful, beautiful graphics. You gotta love this. Been so long since been into this game. Broken chains. Solus is freeing slaves. Solus hates slavery. One of the few things we actually agreed on. He said the other elven gods were tyrants who oppressed his people. He was trying to help them. What do you see? No sign of Solus. Just a big glowing window or mirror or something. Well, that sounds ominous. There we go, guys. I need to make sure I explore around a little bit more as we're going. Usually, though, the intro doesn't give a whole lot, but... Ancient elves doing something to a dragon, I think. Yeah. Trying to control it, maybe? Solus said the other elven gods were evil. If they were binding dragons, he was right about that much, at least. More demons. <laughs> First, have access to powerful two-handed weapons such as great axes or mauls. The attack is slower than those with the weapon shield, but inflict more damage. Basic defend is replaced with timing fin when using the left button.
I'm gonna go back to shield and sword. I like it better. There must be a way to open it. Let's look around. Air's full of magic. Solus used a lot of power for something. Solus, the Dreadwolf, Fen Harel. He's got a lot of names. I always called him Chuckles. Oh, I got a health potion. Nice work. Let's see what's on the other side. Hmm. Intriguing. What do we have down here? That reflection is awesome. I think it's an alluvian. I've seen a few in Olithan Forest. They're elven. It acts like a doorway from one place to another. Solus uses them to get around quickly. He must have gone through it. Let's step through and check this out, shall we? Well, we're not in Manrathus anymore. I know these trees. This is Arlathan Forest. And there's your ritual. The power involved. I've never seen anything like it. Please. The tremors are getting worse. And the demons are too. You've got demons. Demons were bad back in Minrathus. The fades a mess this close to the ritual. No telling what could come through. Green jars are ways to get health potions. Does it feel like those tremors are getting worse? Keep moving and try not to think about it. Press X or Y while sprinting. A uh, shield attack too, okay. Nice. Fast up we can go. We get tremors every time one of those big crystals at the ritual site lights up. Not many of them left to light. Where we go that way? What's over here? Anything? Yeah, that's why you gotta start looking around. Yes, there's stuff all over. Don't need a heal, but if I did, there'd be a potion there too. Or a teleporting attack. Kind of cool. No 
We're doing pretty good on health until now. Wow, we gotta fight a beast. We have to stop this demon quickly. Watch the lightning. Oh. Dang. Oh, I didn't see his hair. How did the demon this large get through the veil? It's a pride demon. Damn thing probably sent Solus's ego. Everyone all right? Good enough. Let's get to Solus. Sure? Positive. You three just keep the demons off me while I talk to him. Varric, Solus isn't gonna stop just because an old friend asks nicely. Solus needs someone to sell him another option to help him justify changing his mind. Yeah, go for it. We've got your back. If anyone can get through to him, you can. Thanks, Rook. Whatever else he is, he's my friend. And if he won't listen to me, and he'll hear from Bianca. More demons. Take care of the team for me. Uh oh. We're gonna lose him. Hey, Chuckles. Hope I'm not interrupting. Good old Garrett. I'm not looking happy. Let's buy him some time. I hope Beric is getting through to Solus. He better talk fast. We can't hold these demons off forever. is a wound inflicted upon this world it must be healed by drowning the world in demons i have taken precautions to minimize the damage varic minimize them people are dying right now you need to listen please not beyond me People are always dying. It is what they do. Shit. We need a better plan. Do you want me to take the shot? Won't work. He's too powerful. What if we disrupt the ritual? How? See those statues? If we break the scaffolding holding that one up, the whole thing will come down on Solus. It's risky. Interrupting a ritual at this scale will have consequences. And what about the demons? Varric needs us to hold them off. Right. You two stay here. I'll bring down the statue. What? No. Stepping into all that raw magic is suicide. The storm could tear you apart. Anyone got a better idea? Nope. Fine. But you'll need backup. I'm with you. I'm a mage. I'll go. 
Either way, someone needs to stay back and deal with the demons. Uh, I think I want Neve. Let's go, Nev. Harding, keep the demons busy. Good luck. I might need some magical advice here. down the veil, knowing all the lives it'll cost. We shared a journey years ago. Do you believe that I would do this if there was some other better option? The pillar's weak, but it isn't falling. We need to push it. Right. Together. Uh. Now. You came a long way and made a valiant effort, Varric, but this story does not end with my downfall. Wow, okay. That's not good. There we go. The start of an age. I hope you enjoyed the intro here. We're going to see if we got a pause screen here. You have no idea what you have done. Solus? I know what I did. I stopped you from destroying the world. I was not destroying the world. When you disrupted my ritual, the magical energies pulled me here, into the fate. Okay, so that's why you're here. But why am I here? Your physical body is unconscious, but you shed a few drops of blood at the ritual site. Enough for a tenuous connection. Blood magic? Firstly, I abhor the use of blood magic. Secondly, had I the power to control you, I would already have used it. Oh, 
All right, you brought me here to talk. What are we talking about? The Evanurus, or as you would call them, the Elven Gods. The creatures that escaped. In ancient times, they ruled the Elves, but that was not enough. They sought not just to be obeyed, but to be worshipped. When I rebelled, they drew on the horrific magic of the Blight, corrupting all they saw until I trapped them. Thanks to you, though, I am now trapped, and the Blighted Elven Gods walk free. Thanks to me, I wasn't the one performing a big ritual to free them. Free them? My mortal enemies. I was ensuring that they would never escape their prison. You were tearing down the veil. I had a plan. Varric always said you'd have a big explanation for why none of this was your fault. Varric? Yeah, he said that's your style. Never quite lies, clever half-truths that let you convince yourself you're doing the right thing. He tried to talk to you anyway, and now he's hurt. Varric is... quite practiced at shading the truth himself. So those things that got out, you said they were gods? They said they were gods. Blighted, tyrannical, sadistic gods. It took all my power to imprison them millennia ago, but I am certain you will be fine. That's really helpful. What are you, the elven god of sarcasm? Lies, treachery, and rebellion, depending upon the story. And how could I help? I do not have my ritual dagger. I cannot access my network of mirrors to travel from the lighthouse to anywhere in the world. All I can offer is what I know. Helpful advice from the elven god of, and I am quoting you here, lies, treachery, and rebellion. Depending on the story. Elganan and Gilanane are your problem to solve. This is your responsibility now. Hmm. This is your responsibility now. Well, look who's still with us. Varric? You're okay. But I saw Sola stab you. You fell. Trust me, kid. I've had worse. And it'd take more than a flesh wound to stop me. <coughs> Don't think I'll be making it out to the field anytime soon, though. Got more down there. Yeah, we'll go down there. What had happened? What happened? I did my best to talk sense into Solus, but of course he wasn't listening. He never does. The plan did go a little wrong. Yeah, Harding got everyone out by the skin of her teeth, mostly. Before you start worrying, Nev will be fine. She's apparently a lot tougher than both of us put together. <laughs> or, at least, she's a lot tougher than me. Beric, when we stopped the ritual, something else got out. Something even Solus is afraid of. You've got this, Rook. World's not flooded with demons right now. Because you stopped Solus, not me. Varric, even so, I need you to- Rook, you've got this. I've seen your work. Like the expedition where you lost that invaluable map, but saved your friends. There's a reason I dragged you into this whole Solus mess. You're clever, adaptable, and you don't know when to quit. <laughs> Rook, look who's awake. I've been searching the place for Lyrian potions. Didn't mean to intrude. Not at all. I was just about to have a look around. Oh, be careful if you go outside, Rook. It is a long way down. The Alluvian led us into something, and it's in the Fade. Because that's what we needed. The dream world. And I really need to look around. <sighs> Can't hurt. In theory. And we need to talk about our next move. Maybe find Harding? She went outside somewhere. 
There's a table in the central area here. I'll meet you both there. Go ahead, Rook. Me. I need to sleep. See you later, kid. He's not doing good. But there we are. That's the introduction. They're pretty good, don't you think? So now we're we're ready to move on, explore around, see what goodies we can find. So we're gonna do that on the next episode. Like always, I enjoyed having you here. Give me a like if you enjoyed this with me. If uh, you're new to the channel, give me that subscribe, and we will see you on the next one.